WWE 2K24 will be releasing this week. And I think I am actually going to get this game. I do have AEW Fight Forever, which I still play. Um, but I haven't played a 2K game in quite some time. And the one thing that is always up for contention is the rating. So, this video, we're going to look at the Raw, SmackDown, and NXT player character wrestler ratings whatever you want to call them see who who's good uh who who's and who got the shaft because there are a few but let's start with nxt all right so as you can see on the screen we have andre chase 73 axiom 73 baron corbin this is the first one 76 um i i originally felt maybe it was a downgrade to go to NXT, but it's still Baron Corbin. He's still very good. I would have liked to see Baron Corbin at maybe an 80 or an 81 if this was bum ass Baron Corbin, he'd be 100. We got Blair, De Blair Devonport at 74, Brooks Jensen 67, Carmelo Hayes 81. Now I know he's an NXT, but we know how good Melo is. He's another person I would like to see at around an 83. 84. We got Channing Stacks, Lorenzo 69, Cora Jade 74, Damon Kemp 74, Dijak 77. Um, that one seems about right. Drew Gulak is too low at a 70. Uh, guys, one of the best technical wrestlers on the planet. It's got to be at least a 75. New Cuts is 71. Fallon Henry 66. Gigi Dola, my wifey. Well, one of my wifey's 74. Ilya Dragunov 81. I like to see him at 82 or 83. JC Jean, 73. Joe Coffey, 76. Joe Gacy, 73. Josh Briggs, 69. We got Lara Vicaria. We don't know what her rating is. She's DLC. Uh, Mark Coffey, 74. Nathan Frazier, 75. Nikita Lyons, 73. Noam Dar, 76. Roxanne Perez, 78. I would like to see Roxanne in the 80. Um, she's called the Prodigy for a reason script 61 that's just wow disrespectful there at least make him a 68 thea hell 72 tony d'angelo 75 trick williams 78 seems it seems fair for trick it seems fair wendy chu 72 wesley part of me thinks wesley is a little low at a 76 maybe a 78 and wolfgang 70 Six. So honestly, I don't have much to say about the NXT rings. I, I, again, I think Corbin, Mello are a little low. Bruns dragging off. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? But that that seems good. And then Roxanne Perez, should, for in my opinion, should be higher. We move over to Monday Night Raw. Let's see what we got here. Adam Pierce, Akira Tozawa, Alexa Bliss, 83. Um, I think Alexa Bliss is overrated. But 83, I get. I, I get it. Apollo Crews, 71. Becky Lynch, 94. Big E at 78. Now, this is the first major one. I understand that he is out with an injury. But come on, 78 for... Big E, that's Snow S. Bueno. Braun Strowman, 82. Bronson Reed, 84. Brutus Key, 78. Candice LeRae, 67. Is just disrespectful to Candice LeRae. This will be one of the first ratings that I will be changing in the game. She's one of the most underrated wrestlers in the WWE, and we know what she's capable of. Candice LeRae is at least a 75. Mella, 74. Chad Gable, like an 80 seems right, but I feel like an 83 would be better. Um, the guy's just too good in the ring. Chelsea Green, 75. We got Punk. Cody, 93. Seems right. Damien Priest, 86. Right. Dexter Loomis, 66. Again, that is too low. I feel like the, the way might get shafted in all of their ratings. Dominic Mysterio, 83. Drew McIntyre, 89. 
He's got to be a 90. He should be at least a 90. Eric Rowan. Eric Rowan. Eric of the Viking Raiders, 78. Finn Balor, 87. That's that's cool. That That's cool. Giovanni Vinci, 72. Gunther, 90. Yeah, now, yes, 90s are the best. I feel like Gunther is better than a 90. I feel like Gunther has to be higher. 91, 92 for Gunther. Uh, Indy Hartwell, 63, a little too low. She's a former NXT Women's Champion. So, yeah, the way they get shafted. So, 70 for Indy. Ivar, 79. Ivy Nile, 73. That's cool. JD McDonough, 73 should be higher. Jay Uso, 90. I think 90 is too high. He's, he's, I know he's main event Jay Uso. 88 seems good for Jay. Jinder Mahal, 74. I would like to see him at a 76. Uh, Johnny Gargano, 74. Too low for him. I would like to see him at a 78 to an 80. Julius Creed, Katana Chance, Kaden Carter. Kofi, 80. Disrespectful. Kofi at an 80 is disrespectful. At the very least, got to make my man an 85. Liv Morgan, 85. I like that. Uh, Lubert Kaiser, 73. That's cool. What do we have for the rest of the Raw roster? Maxine Dupree, 64. And Natalia, 81. Ijax is a... DLC Nikki Cross 62. That's still low for Nikki. Uh, Otis 74. Gotta, gotta get my man into 77. Piper Nevin 79. That seems good. Raquel Rodriguez 86. Way too high. She is just a smile and a big bag. There's no way. There's no way that Raquel Rodriguez is. Is or should be one of the highest rated women in this game over spoiler alert Shayna Baszler over Liv Morgan over Carmella. I, I just she shouldn't be that high. Rhea Ripley 96 obviously makes sense. Ricochet 81. I would like an 83. Sammy's good at 87. Sangha Seth at a 93. That's that's good. Now you see. Now you see where I, well, when I said I think Gunther should be be just a tad bit higher. Shane in 82. Shinsuke 84. I'd like to see him in 85 or 86. Sonya Deville 74. Tegan Knox 77. That's cool. Miz 81. I'd like him to be a little bit higher. Tommaso Ciampa 76 higher. Bahala 63. Veer Mahan 75. Xavier Woods 78. Should be at an, at least an 80. Zia Lee, 73. And Zoe Stark at a 78. That's not... Those aren't those aren't bad. Those, those aren't bad. We move over to the SmackDown roster. AJ Styles, 85. Too low. Should at the very least be an 88. He has... It's, it's AJ Styles. Um, Alba Fire, 74. I'm fine with that. Andrew Garza should be at least a 71, 72, 67 is too low. Angelo Dawkins, 74. That, for a tag team specialist, I would have liked to see him at a 77. Ashanti, Asuka at a 90. Asuka is still a 90. That is dope. That, that's, that's good for Asuka. Uh, Austin Theory, 72. Here's one that I think is really egregious. I think Theory should be somewhere in the 80s. Coming off of that win against John Cena at WrestleMania, he should be at the very least an 81 or an 82. Be fair. Bailey at an 85 breaks my heart. 88. 85. Like, so now you're telling me that Raquel Rodriguez is better than Bailey. Nah, that's 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 not it. Bianca Belair at a 95. Makes sense. Lashley at 89. I'm back and forth on this because he, he he could be a 90 as well. Braun Burke in an 80. That will grow. Um, let's see what we got. Butch 75. Butch is 75. Pete Dunn's like an 83. Cameron Grimes 73. Carlitos DLC. Kathy Kelly. Cedric Alexander 69. A little low. Charlotte at a 92. I get why she's at a 92. I don't. Um, I don't hate it. Cruz Del Toro, 69. Dakota Kai, 78. Yeah, Dragon Lisa. 
Hey, where has he been? Wow. DLC, Elton Prince, 76. Grayson Waller, 74. I could take him being a little bit higher. Humberto Carrillo should be a 70. Isla Dawn, 74. EO, 88. I like that she's high. She should be higher. EO's a 90. Uh, Jimmy Uso, 84. 85. Feels right. Joaquin Mouse, 68. Kyrie Sings, DLC. Luke Gallows. I'm sorry, Carl Anderson, 72. Karrion Cross, 75. As much as I think the guy is hot trash, I feel like 75 is too low for him. KO at an 86. Mm, 87 sounds sounds better. Kit Wilson, 76. LA Knight, yeah. 88. Now, that, I think, is hot. Is it, is it wrong to say LA Knight at a 78 is high? <sighs> I think so. <sighs> 86? Logan Paul at a 90 is just absurd. No way. No, no way. So you're telling me Logan, you have Logan Paul above LA Knight, Kevin Owens, Bobby Lashley, like Shinsuke Nakamura, AJ Styles, that's Drew McIntyre. That's a, that's that's a little weird, wrong right there. Luke Gallows at a seventy-three. Meech in sixty-eight needs to be higher. Montez Ford, seventy-six. I would like to see a seventy-eight. MVP sixty-eight. Omar seventy-six. Pat McAfee is DLC. Paul Heyman, R Truth 67, disrespectful. R Truth should be 100, no matter what. Randy at a 91. See, now I feel like this is kind of high for Randy. Just because he was out for so long. I, ugh. 90 seems better. Rim Sarah, 88. Rich Holland, 76. Robert Roos, 67. Roman Reigns, 97. Can't really argue with that. Santos Escobar is another one I think is kind of low. 83 should be for Santos. Scarlet, Sheamus 86, Shotzi 76, uh, Solo 86 seems good, Tamina 67, Tiffany Stratton 79, yeah, I'm I'm good, Tyler Bates 76, Zelina Vega 74, so I feel like the SmackDown ratings are more on par than what the Raw ratings are, I mean, AJ is definitely low. I think Austin Theory is actually really low. He's way too low. Um, Bailey being 85 is that midway point where I'm like, so who's better than Bailey? You have Oscar, you have Becky, you have Maria, you have Bianca, which I, I am perfectly fine with, but then you have Raquel Rodriguez over Bailey. That, no. No. Um,. I even think Charlotte at a 92 is slightly high because she's just always injured. A 90 would have been fine. Jimmy, 84 is a little low. Um, but most, in, uh, Logan Paul is just disrespectful at a 90. That's just wrong. Same thing goes for NXT. I think NXT is just fine. I definitely would have loved to see Roxanne Perez just a little bit higher. Same thing with Mello. And for Raw, the most egregious one is probably The New Day. All three of them are way too low. And Candice LeRae is too low. But those are the Raw, SmackDown, and NXT ratings. Come back for the Legends ratings. We're going to have some fun. With that, check out the socials, check out the schedule for this week. I will see you when I see you. Peace.